Hey everybody, welcome back to Bob Key TV. For this installment, my three favorite team kits, jerseys of all time, and my three least favorite of all time. Let's start with my favorites. Uh, Brooklyn Chewing Gum. Very classic, iconic design. Red, white, and blue. Triangle from the shoulders to the middle of the chest, and then stripes going down towards the waist. The Gypsy, Roger Devlamic, Mr. Perry Roubaix. One of the most stylish professionals in the history of bike racing. Was a member of that squad. Loved those jerseys. Peugeot. White background. Black checkers. Like the checker flag across the chest. And just Peugeot. Absolutely gorgeous design. I love those jerseys. Always dreamed of being on that team. But it was winding down when I was getting started. But some of the best English speaking racers of all time. Race with them. Sean Yates. Uh, Stephen Roche. Robert Millar, um, Alan Piper, Phil Anderson, and even Eddie Merricks rode for that team early in his career. But my favorite jersey of all time, uh, with all due modesty, has got to be the 7-Eleven Hoonved jerseys that we raced on uh, in the 80s and uh, into 1990. Red, white, and green, very stylish, uh, technically, the technical merits of these jerseys um, have yet to be surpassed. There's great jerseys now with maybe more advanced materials, but the fit, the comfort, the aerodynamics, and the durability of these jerseys was quite remarkable. Made by Dassault in Switzerland, and um, the technical attributes never surpassed. Love these jerseys. Um, and every time I wear this, people compliment me, even if they have no idea. They're like, nice jersey, dude. Um, my least favorites, mm. Le Groupe Mont, a team from the early 90s, and it was like a modern art nightmare <laughs> unfolding on these jerseys. All kinds of weird shapes, odd colors, and just Le Groupe Mont. Team folded after a few months. I'm not sure if it was a jersey. <laughs> the jersey was so bad, the company did not want to be associated with how horrible the riders looked. Uh, Phonak, the puke green of the Phonak squad and the green shorts, just no, not so much. Horrible. Very plain, uninspired, and uh, just, uh, just a horrible, I would, I don't know, you'd have to be paid a lot of money to wear that jersey. <laughs> and uh, the worst of all time, however, Futon Servetto. Oh my gosh, wow. Light brown jersey and shorts. Almost impossible to pick out in the peloton. Uh, looked just like the dirt by the side of the road. Uh, the Futon Cervetto jersey, phew, baby. That team folded also. <laughs> um, uh, so if you want your team to last a while, think of a nice, classic, gorgeous jersey. It cannot be that hard to do. Um, for the next installment, I'm gonna do the current World Tour, 18 teams, three favorite, three least favorite. So that'll be next. Thanks everybody for your comments, and thanks for subscribing. Tootaloo.